It's post time for the third division of the New Jersey Sire Stakes. Three-year-old pacing fillies. Off stride, Gemini Genie the one back pacing, but about six lengths behind as they near the start. And they're off. Queen Otra from the outside gets the first call. Toward the inside is Earhart Hanover. In between horses, Sweet Sacrosu, Apple Crisp pacing out as well. These four across the track early. Nadia's life on the inside slides up fifth. About two lengths further back, racing in seventh is Megan's Bell. Eighth is Gemini Genie, who spotted the field some lengths behind the gate. Ninth and under some mild urging as they head around the turn toward the opening quarter, Gina Spur, and then it's School of Cardnax, who is the trailer. Opening quarter in 27 and 2. Earhart Hanover has the lead, and she's two lengths in front as they move on to the back stretch. Apple Crisp is racing in second. Parked and pressing on Sweet Sacrosu up on the outside. She's now second and gunning for the front. Nadia's life is into the bit. She's hard held there in fourth. Queen Otra on the inside is fifth. Then Megan's Bell. Gemini Genie races in seventh. Eighth is Gina Spur. And School of Card Knox is the trailer. Sweet Sacrosu cleared. But here's the give and go from Earhart Hanover who's right back out and rolling for the retake as they reach the half. 55 and 2. Apple Crisp is tipped to the outside. First over. Nadia's Life hoping to utilize that cover. She's second over. Queen Otra races in fifth. Megan's Bell on the outside is racing sixth. Seventh is Gemini Genie. School of Card Knox gaining some ground. She's now eighth on the rim, and Gina Spur trails the field. Earhart Hanover leads it coming to three quarters. Apple Crisp is just off her wheel, but looking to drop back in behind her for a brief breather there in second. Three quarters, 123 and two, and it's Earhart Hanover starting to edge away at the top of the stretch. Brennan has kicked out the earplugs, and she's three lengths clear. Apple Crisp is racing in second. Nadia's life is third. Queen Otra on the outside is moving up. Megan's Bell on the far outside. Earhart Hanover is wrapped up at the edge of the tow board, and she leads it by three as they head to the finish. Apple Chris trying to save second. It's Earhart Hanover, very tight for second between Apple Crisp and Queen Otra, 151 and four. Turning to the winner's circle is number two, Earhart Hanover, an art escape three year old filly out of I. Carl's El Grande by Direct Scooter. All by Ian Smith of Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island. Steve Elliott, the trainer, and George Brennan is in the sulky. Earhart Hanover, second victory of the season, 151 and four. Career best effort for Earhart Hanover. In the winner's circle, Greg Bomer to make the trophy presentation. Winning trainer, Steve Elliott, and driver George Brennan. Number two, Earhart Hanover, a Dave Brower selection, 260, 240, 220. Second, number three, Apple Crisp, 660, three even. And finishing third, the seven, Queen Otra, 260 to show. Brower exact a 2-3, 1980, 2 3, seven, try, 52 60. And the pick three of 692 pays $77.20. The upcoming sixth race, start of the pick four, races six through nine. There are no changes in the sixth, also exacta and trifecta.